Hello friends, this is Caroline. I just want to say thank you so much for your beautiful support of this channel over the past year and more importantly thank you for the beautiful light you are holding and planting into the earth and transmitting out not just hundreds but probably thousands of miles out from where you live on the earth and as the light pouring onto the planet gets stronger we all get stronger even though Yes, we might feel exhausted from integrating all these powerful light codes and we might feel some days that things are just a bit much because old struggles, old challenges are coming up to the surface, but they're only doing that so that we can finally heal and release them and stop identifying with sadness and loss and anger and all the density of third dimensional earth and deep down I think we all know this. I just want to give thanks for the beauty of where I have been living the past 18 months in Santa Fe, New Mexico for the forest, the high desert, the beautiful people who are here, absolutely wonderful, good-hearted human beings, the phenomenal presence and blessing of the Pueblo and Navajo people and so many others who are called indigenous who are really just the human beings who have been here and connected to their beautiful cultures for thousands of years. And we give thanks for the beauty of life and of this season, whatever may be going on in the world or in our individual lives, we give thanks and are astounded that Every year, no matter what's going on, the beauty of this holiday season of Hanukkah, Christmas, Kwanzaa, the winter solstice, and so on, and then the New Year celebrations that visits us, regardless, just like the sun returning every morning, regardless of what you and I are experiencing. So there are some things we can count on in this life. These are eternal and powerful. I'm asking the collective to assist us now in releasing whatever has been sort of sitting in our energy very heavily. Maybe it's so familiar to us we don't even know that it's really an intrusion or some old density we brought forth from another life and just, just breathe out right now. Just allow yourself to release whatever you're carrying for yourself a loved one or people who are suffering thousands of miles from where you're sitting. Whatever it is, we hold all troubled areas in that beautiful white flame of the Divine Feminine. We hold our lives in that white flame, knowing it transmutes and put the whole earth in that or the transmuting violet flame of Saint Germain with great thanks to Divine Mother all the ascended masters are just releasing right now. Just breathe out. We're not here to carry burdens. Not anymore. That was the old earth and we're bringing in the new one. Give thanks for where you are right now, wherever that is. That might be a challenge and yet I don't know any better way to climb up on top of something that's difficult other than to give thanks for it. Integrate the challenge. And now we'll ask that these dear ones, these beautiful angels, archangels, ascended masters, star nation, and fey elders, that they bless us for the coming year. We ask for clear direction. We call forth divine guidance in all matters of life. We call forth special healing for ourselves and loved ones, for our community, for those who are unhoused, underserved populations, children who are confused, abandoned, mistreated. Sending light to all of these dear ones, our elders, those with disabilities. Bringing in the light 
anchoring that so perfectly in our energies. So that we know that no matter what, we belong to higher light. Nothing can separate us from that. And in this I share a few scenes of Santa Fe at Christmas time because it's just absolutely amazing. Sending many blessings and much love, dear ones. Thank you for all you are and all you give to us. Namaste.